Hey everybody, we're gonna do another video today. So these are the Leupold McKenzie 10 by 42 binoculars and their MSRP is $199. Seen a few places lately on sale for anywhere from $127 to $135. So if you're wanting a pair of binoculars from that price range, let's see how they, how they are. Uh, they come with this decent soft case. It's got a pocket here for the strap. For the next strap, the attachment is a little bungee right here. Just clips right there, real secure. Um, and one of the neat things about this case, say you're wearing a harness or belt or something like that, and you can't unhook it, this, it actually has double, and they've got buckles on them, so you can slide them over anything you want. Uh, wanna attach them to your tree stand or something like that, don't want them directly on you. So that's the case, it's a pretty nice case, uh, especially for come with a you know, $199 set of binoculars. They are a flat, medium gray in color. They've got nice stippling here on the backs and the sides, smooth on top. And the your main focus right here in the middle, nice and easy to move with one finger. Your right eye focus, real stiff, just like it should be. So let's look through them. There now, I, a lot of people don't know. So the eye cups, you know, use a lot of times you'll see the rubber eye cups you fold over. If you've got glasses on, screw them in. If you don't have glasses on, you screw them out. That should give you a little better view. I've got glasses on. I've got them screwed most of the way in. And then, not everybody's left eye and right eye is the same. So if it's not, if if it doesn't look as in focus as you want it to, when you get it up get in focus then close your right eye all right now it's focused for my left right there now I'm gonna open both and again I got the right eye focus is right here so once I, I know it's focused for my left now I'm gonna move that right eye oh yeah now it's a lot better both eyes are in focus now so I wanted to do this video in the evening. As every hunter knows, the evening is the hardest time to see. Uh, I'll show you kind of what I'm looking at right over here, this tree line. As you can see, looking directly in the sun, it's sun's going down. Pretty hard to see over there. So that's 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 my view right now. And so I know I've got them focused at the distance of that tree line they're pretty clear uh, I can see I can actually see really well even looking directly where the sun's at over there I can still see really well there they do have very minimal glare on them uh, when I look directly where the sun's at they've got very minimal glare but as soon as I get any any away from that at all there's no glare whatsoever once I get away from that so very for $199 they they're very good binoculars uh, you said these are the 10 by 42 um, I went with the 10s I got I bought these for work I would look at I work on the river when I'm looking for stuff I'm looking for you know logs and things like that that might be in my way making sure it's not people in uh, John boats and typically I'm looking anywhere from a thousand feet to half a mile to my or to a mile and seven power not quite enough power sometimes I need to see something fast 12 14 power binoculars sometimes it's too hard to find uh, I find 10 to be a nice medium you know if I want to find something quick I can look at it it's got a wide enough field of view I can find it quick, but 10 power is still a good enough view, good enough zoom that I can still see really well. So just, you know, when you're looking for power, they do make these in different powers. Kind of want to consider what you're looking for. Uh, again, seem to be really good binoculars. Leupold McKenzie, 10 by 42 and $199 MSRP. So if that's something you're interested in, I advise you check them out. 
I, I think I'm gonna like them. If I find something I don't like or really like about them in the next few months, I'll do another video. If you have any questions or any suggestions of something you'd like to see, let me know.